Good morning. Today we're talking about being consumed by the Holy Spirit. And our reading today takes place in Matthew chapter 3, verses 11 and 12. It says, I indeed baptize you with water. This is John the Baptist speaking. I indeed baptize you with water unto repentance. But he who is coming after me is mightier than I, whose sandals I am not worthy to carry. He will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. His winnowing fan is in his hand, and he will thoroughly purge his threshing floor and gather his wheat into the barn, but he will burn up the chaff with unquestionable fire. You know, when we receive the Lord into our life, we ask Jesus to come into our hearts. We have the Holy Spirit. That's the Holy Spirit that draws us to himself. But as we grow in his grace and as we grow in his knowledge, as we continually um, do the things that the Lord asks us to do by reading his word, by going to church and fellowshipping with other believers, we continually grow with the Lord. But there comes a time in our life where we need that overflowing of the Holy Spirit. And we ask the Lord to fill us to overflowing so we may spill out to others the, the goodness of God. God has a special thing for you. God has a special prayer language for you. And I encourage you to seek that. We want to be consumed with the Holy Spirit. We want to have him cleanse our hearts that if anything gets impure, anything that's not pleasing to the Lord, because we want to live um, holy and acceptable before him. The song I'd like to sing for you today is a, kind of an Israeli um, feel. It's called Consume Me. If you don't know it, the words are very easy. It says, consume me, consume me in your fire, Lord. Consume me, consume me with your love. Join me in worship today. on today that they've never had the prayer language that you would bless them with your Holy Spirit with the overflow consume them Lord with your Holy Spirit we ask Lord to for you to clean out anything in our lives that's not pleasing to you bless us today in the things that we do go before us and prepare the way we thank you Lord for all your blessings and your goodness to us in your precious and holy name we pray amen have a great day with God